Hi, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can fix a problem with your Apple Magic Keyboard not working, not connecting or not pairing uh, with your computer, your iMac or even your uh, Mac Pro or the MacBook Pro. So let's uh, look at some of the things that you could try. Now the first thing is make sure that the switch at the top here is uh, switch on. Now this is a later model. Um, if you have a newer model, then you may need to press on the power button on the side uh, to switch it on. Now with the newer model, there is a switch at the top here. I can simply just slide it back and forth to uh, switch it on or off. So make sure it is uh, switch on. The second step is if you press on the cap key, make sure the lights turn on. If the light is not on, Perhaps it is out of battery. So just plug it in and make sure you have your Apple keyboard uh, charge it up. So it won't take long. Just plug it in for a few hours and um, see if it charge it up. You can also check on your computer to make sure that it is charged. Now I know that because the keyboard is not working so you might not be able to use the computer. So uh, in that case, try to plug in another keyboard if you have one spare at home or you could borrow one from your friend or you can go to the store, the retail store and get another cheap keyboard. You don't have to get an expensive one, just get a cheap keyboard just so you can plug it in and uh, you can control your computer. Now on your computer, we want to make sure that the keyboard is not the problem. Uh, so we want to uh, plug it into the computer. Now on the PC, make sure that Bluetooth is connected. So here you can see if I turn up Bluetooth, then of course the keyboard is going to be disconnected because it is connecting via Bluetooth. So make sure it is connecting uh, Bluetooth is turned on and it's make sure it is connected. So we can click on that and here you can see uh, my keyboard is connected and it shows battery level is 100%. If the battery is low down to 0 or 1% and it's not working, it will show it here and you need to um, uh, make sure that it is uh, working. Now another thing that you can do is try to unpair the keyboard and then pair it again. So on the Bluetooth here, click on the Bluetooth and then click on open Bluetooth uh, preferences. And in here, you can simply just go down and uh, remove it. So I'm going to just unpair. So, so you have to pair this device again if you want to use it later. So I'm just going to tap on removed. And then try to pair it again. Sometimes that can help uh, fix the problem. Now again, you can see I have been doing all this without using an additional keyboard. So you know, if you don't have a keyboard, uh, you can still use the mouse. Now if you have a password uh, on your computer system and you cannot um, use a keyboard, then try to use um, someone else's keyboard, borrow your friend's keyboard, or uh, get a cheap one online. Okay, once you're ready, you can always uh, press on the pair button again. And this will pair with the keyboard right here. So you can see it's, a, uh, it's connected and I can press on the cap key to confirm that it is working so here you go you can see and you can test it by opening up note so I have opened up notes and we can test it now you can see it is now tapping correctly so yeah just those are the things that you can try to um, uh, fix your keyboard connections make sure it is charged make sure that it is uh, switch on uh, make sure that Bluetooth is switched on. If Bluetooth is switched on, you can try to unpair it and then pair it again and see if that fixes the problem. You might need, also need to restart your computer, reboot your computer, and then try to pair your keyboard again. So hopefully one of the solutions uh, can fix with your Apple keyboard uh, issue. Thank you for watching this uh, video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.